Hey my lovies, welcome back to my channel. Excuse my voice, I'm a little sick. Today we're gonna start by moisturizing our face and priming our face and spraying some Mario Badascu facial spray. I'm gonna start with my eyebrows. I'm using Dip Brow by Anastasia and Medium Brown. Then I'm going to conceal my eyelids with this Pro Concealer from LA Girl and then I'm going to blend it with my beauty sponge but I'm just gonna dab it so I won't really move the product around and then I'm going to use this powder to set the concealer so it won't move around and it will be easier for me to blend in my eyeshadows I'm going to be using my Mario's palette with Anastasia and I'm gonna start with the first color as my transition shade just to have a base for the other darker colors that I'm going to be applying and after that color I am going to be using the darker brown there and I'm going to apply it into my crease again just so you know cutting up the crease more because I am going for a cut crease glittery eye if you know what I mean if you understand because I don't understand myself sometimes especially now that I can't speak and then right here I was just having like a little combo with my little brother. And then I'm going to use the same color that I started with just to blend that darker brown in. Then I'm going to move on to my Renaissance palette. And I'm going to use the darker brown in the palette just to darken up my crease a little more and kind of give that cut crease look. Because you know, Mario's palette, it's not enough. Like, I need to use both of them. They're like my favorite palettes right now. Then, afterwards, I'm gonna use the orange shade there and I'm just gonna blend everything together just so that it could look a little more neat, blended, and you know. Before I sprayed and apply my glitter, I actually used the shade Fifth Avenue from the Mario's palette. So that the glitter could have something to like stick on and then i just applied my glitter and this is actually not glitter for your eyes this is glitter for your body but if you're using this type of glitter just make sure your eyes are closed because oof, it's getting glitter in your eyes it's not fun then i took the colors that we started with and just blended everything together i used a different brush with the darker color that we used from the mario palette just to cut the crease a little more because you know we need it to be more cut afterwards i moved on to mascara and my liner and as you can see they're both even so i'm happy then i moved on to correcting my under eyes because you know my bags are just hideous so i'm using this orange color from la pro whatever my choice is the Pro Concealer from LA Girl and then I am moving on to highlighting and contouring from my Dustovian palette and then I used the other color there as my foundation and then after that I used the LA Pro Concealer under my eyes just to line it up a little and after that I just set my under eyes for like a minute and then I just moved on to my BH Cosmetics palette and started to contour my cheeks, my forehead, my chin, and my nose. Honestly, I like to barely speak. Like, I sound crazy. Really crazy. Like, I probably miss said words without even noticing. But that's okay. After that, I used my NYC bronzer. Well, before that, I actually started dancing. Did you know that? Beat. But after that, I used my NYC bronzer to bronze my face and get a little more color. And then after that, I used my Jaclyn Hills palette or collab with 
um, Becca and I use the um, uh, what am I trying to say? The blush there, the middle one, and oh, thanks God they brought this palette back. But you know, it was like a rush because you know it was gonna be out of stock right away. And then after I apply my blush, I used Champagne Pop and the color next to it. And after applying those two, I moved on to my Anastasia's Glow Glow Kit. And I applied the first two bottom shades because since the Jacqueline Hills has like a little bit of like fallout, like glitter, the Anastasia one is more like, um, I don't know how to explain it, but I don't know, it makes it a little more natural, like less glittery, more like shiny from like, like that's just how shiny. And then after that, I just bathed myself in my Mario spade. I love this thing and then I moved on to the shades that we first started with and apply them to our under eyes and then I used the Marc Jacobs black liner in my waterline and then I applied mascara and then I came back and used champagne pop in my outer corners my nose my pupils bowl because you know I really didn't apply my highlight otherwise. But after that, I just aligned my lips. I don't know what colors to use. And I use my icon from Huda Beauty and the Mac Doll from Anastasia. And this is what I came up with. Well, my lovies, thank you for watching. I hope you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye.